Three grams of musk oil are required for each bottle of Mink Caress, a very popular perfume made by a small company in western Siberia. The cost of musk oil is 150 rubles per kilogram. Budgeted production of Mink Caress is given below by quarters for the second year and for the first quarter of the third year. Let's go ahead first and calculate our production needs for the second year. We'll do that. We're told that um, each bottle of perfume requires three ounces of musk oil. So our production needs in terms of musk oil for the first quarter are 180,000 grams. That's the 60,000 bottles times three grams per bottle. For the second quarter, we'll need 270,000 grams. That's the 90,000 bottles times three grams per bottle. For the third quarter, we'll need 450,000 grams. That's the 150 times three grams per bottle. For the fourth quarter, we'll need 300,000 grams. And for the entire year, our production need for musk oil will be 1,200,000 grams. Before we continue on with our production report, let's review some of the additional information. We're told that musk oil has become so popular as a perfume ingredient that it's necessary to carry large inventories as a precaution against stockouts. For this reason, the inventory of musk oil at the end of each quarter must equal 20% of the following quarter's production needs. We're told that some 36,000 grams of musk oil are on hand at the start of the second quarter and we're asked to prepare a direct materials budget for musk oil uh, for each quarter and in total for the year, and also calculate the amount of our purchases in rubles. Let's go ahead and take a look at our production budget for the first quarter. Our desired ending inventory will be 54,000 grams of musk oil. That's our second quarter sales of 270,000 times 20%. Our total needs then for the first quarter will be 234,000 grams. That's our production needs plus our desired inventory. Since we began the quarter with 36,000 grams of musk oil, we're going to need to purchase an additional 198,000 grams. Our beginning inventory for the second quarter is simply the 54,000 ending inventory from the first quarter. Let's go ahead now and calculate our production needs or rather our desired inventory for the second quarter. Recall that's simply going to be the next quarter's production needs of 450,000 grams times 20%. So our total needs for the second quarter will be 360,000 grams. If we begin with 54,000 grams in beginning inventory, we will need to purchase, we can see, the difference or 306,000 grams in the second quarter. For the third quarter, our beginning inventory is, again, the 90,000 from the prior quarter. Our desired ending inventory is 20% of fourth quarter needs of 300,000. So 300,000 times 20% gives us 60,000. So our total need for musk oil in the third quarter is 510 grams. If we begin the quarter with 90,000 grams, that means we'll need to purchase 420,000 grams. For the fourth quarter, our beginning inventory, again, is carried over from the prior quarter, 60,000 grams. Our desired ending inventory for the fourth quarter will be 42,000 grams. We calculate this by taking first quarter sales from year three, which is 70,000 bottles, multiplying it by three ounces per bottle. And again, we want to then have 20% of that, or 42,000 grams on hand. So our total needs in the fourth quarter will be 342,000. If we begin with 60,000, that means that our required purchases will be 282,000 grams. Let's go ahead and take a look at what we have for the year. Our year ending inventory is going to be 42,000 grams. That's simply our desired inventory at the end of the fourth quarter, which means for the year we'll need 1,242,000 grams of musk oil. Our beginning inventory is from the beginning of the year, or the first quarter's beginning inventory. That's 36,000 grams. So our required purchases for the year will be 1,206,000 grams. We are told that our musk oil costs 150 rubles per kilogram, and a kilogram is 1,000 grams. 
So to calculate the cost of our purchases in the first period, we'll take our purchases in grams, our 198,000. We'll divide it by 1,000 grams per kilogram and then multiply it by 150 rubles per kilogram. And we get 29,700 rubles. The cost of the purchases in the second quarter will be the 306,000 required purchases divided by 1,000 multiplied by 150 rubles per kilogram or $45,900. The cost of the purchases in the, month, in the third quarter will be 63,000 rubles. The cost in the fourth quarter will be 42,300. And the full cost for the entire year will be 180,900 rubles.